what's up, y'all? So, y'all see where I'm at. I'm in bed. I ain't doing, you know, too much of nothing right now. Um, I'm about to get up and start straightening up the house and stuff and so I can get to moving. Um, but man, I just got a call from my sister. And, uh... She just shared with me some, but basically just spoke life into me. Uh, and it's crazy because, like, even when you don't feel like, even when you don't feel like God is working, God is working. Like, I ain't prayed and asked for nothing too. Like I, I don't want to say I didn't pray and ask for anything because I have, but I've been telling God what I wanted, not being long winded about it, and God has been answering my prayers. Like for my sister to call me and say what she said to me, it it just always clarifies to me that God hasn't taken his hands off of me yet. I'm not gonna not gonna lie to you. I cried before I uh turned the camera on <laughs> cause uh my me and my sister we you know we we've always been close and we never really talked talked like but since my mom has passed, like, me and my sister really have been, like, talking. And that shit means so much to me, dog, because everybody needs somebody. And my sister ain't calling me for no reason. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know she ain't calling me for no reason. So when she called me, I don't care what I'm doing or what I'm going through. I pick up the phone because my sister is my strong friend, you know? She's the one that I tell y'all, like, if you have that friend, that strong friend, call and check up on them. My sister is that person. She's that person. So for when for her to call me and you know just talk about anything, life or anything, I don't give a fuck how long it take. Like I I talk to my sister until my fucking phone go dead. Like, and then charge it and talk to her some more because everybody need that, you know. Sometimes a majority of the time or all the time. Crystal, I appreciate you for, even though it may seem really simple to you to say, to say what you said, but bro, like that shit meant so, it means so much to me, not meant, but it means so much to me because it's still sitting with me. It's still sitting with me. Damn, like. Y'all don't get it. Y'all don't understand. Like, man. Uh, like, bro. I'm I'm real deal like in in awe of how God works, bro. Like he works. <sighs> man, he really works. Crystal, I love you, dog. I don't want I don't I don't ever want anything to come in, in between the relationship that we have and how it is because I wouldn't change that shit for the world, bro. I'd rather have some type of relationship than not have a relationship with you at all. Cause you are the glue that keeps everything together. Just how mama did.
And I want you to know that I appreciate you for everything that you did for me and everything that you do for everybody else. If nobody else don't tell you they appreciate you, nigga, I appreciate you. And I tell you that all the time, but today, like, I want to, I want to tell you that, dog, like, like, I want you to know that shit, bro. You are appreciated, bro. You are loved, bro. I see you, bro. If nobody else don't, bro, I see you, bro. If nobody else tell you I love you, I want you to know that I do. And I'm going to post this video so whenever you feel discouraged, whenever you feel sad, whenever you, you know what I'm saying? Like, you'll know, like, you had somebody that, you know what I'm saying? Like, or you have somebody, not had, you know, I rebuke that, you know what I'm saying? But you have somebody that love you, you know what I'm saying? Like, I love you, bro. I love you, bro. And I didn't think that I would have, you know, that much love to give. You know what I mean? Like, being that I have a wife and I have children. Like, God wouldn't have made my heart that big to be able to give a peace to everybody that I meet. You get what I'm saying? But he have, and he did. And I appreciate him for it. To be able to show people the love that they deserve. And not have to take away from the love that I give to, you know, my family. Yeah, man. Whew. But if I tell y'all what she said, y'all, y'all wouldn't even fucking, y'all would be like, oh, why you, you know, but something as simple as, let's just say, I did, I did that, but I'm telling you I did that so you won't fall and bump your head. That's the type of conversation that, you know. Not even a conversation. She just called me to tell me that. That's what we just had. And to me, that me that speaks so much. Because she didn't have to share that with me. But she did. And she just want me to get right. So everybody else around me could be. So I know it's coming. This year, I know that it's coming. I know it's coming. That blessing that I've always wanted is coming this year. It's coming this year. I know it. I know it's coming this year because everything that God has promised me is happening now. So I know that he's building me. So when I do receive it, I know what to do with it, and I don't fuck it up. <sighs> so on that note, y'all, I love y'all, man. I appreciate y'all for always watching and supporting me. I didn't want to do another video like this today, but I had to. Because y'all have to feel me sometimes. Like, I want y'all to feel me. And the shit that I go through on a daily basis to know that you are not alone in this shit, bro. Like, even the people that you feel like have the best lives go through this, but they hide it from you. And I'm not hiding shit from y'all. So I appreciate y'all for being with me. Through this journey while I'm going through what I'm going through mentally, financially, whatever. So when we get blessed, we're going to get blessed together. Believe that shit. So I love y'all, man. I appreciate y'all. And uh, yeah, man, whatever you do, lead with love because love always wins. Hi, right, y'all.